quadratic equations problem solving. I'm Anil Kumar and here is an example on consecutive odd integers. The question is find two consecutive odd integers whose product is 3 to 3, 323. Now what are consecutive odd integers? Numbers like 1, 3, they're odd and they're consecutive. No other odd numbers between them. Or 7, 9, things like that. 11, 13. Or minus 11, minus 13. These are odd consecutive integers. Now, how are you going to define them as variables? We say, let the numbers be x and if both are odd or even in this case we are looking for odd the other is x plus 2 3 and 5 so they have a difference of 2 so that is how you can define two consecutive odd integers now the question is find two consecutive odd integers whose product is 323 that means if you multiply x by x plus 2 you should get 323 that is the question now, fast way of getting the answer is you can square root 323, right, and get approximate answer. This is uh, not the recommended method. What you do is find square root of 323. So what we do is we just do square root of 323. So you get, let's do decimal value, 17.9, right? So two numbers, 17 and 19, probably will give you the right answer. That's kind of a hint. But now, let's follow the method to solve it. Method is, open the brackets, so you get x squared plus 2x equals to 323. Bring them one side, x squared plus 2x minus 323 equals to 0. Now you can apply the quadratic formula or you can factor them. So we found that 17 and 19 are two numbers whose product, that is to say, we found two numbers whose product should be minus minus 320, 323 and whose sum should be plus 2. So the two numbers which work for us are uh, 17 with a minus sign and 19 with a plus sign. That gives you plus 2. So we can factor this as x plus 19 times x minus 70 equals to 0 and now this can be 0 only if x is equals to minus 19 or x is equals to plus 70. Now the solution will be if x is minus 19 so we get one set that is one number is minus 19 the other one is minus 19 plus 2 so one set will be minus 19 and minus 19 plus 2 will give us 17 plus the other one is if I consider 17 as my number, then 17 plus 2 will be 19. So these two are the answers, right? So minus 19, sorry, minus 17, or 17, 19 are consecutive odd integers whose product is 323. So what I want to highlight here is that when we are talking about numbers which are very close or consecutive, you can approximately get the answer by square rooting and then you know which numbers to work with. So this technique helps to find quick answer in the test. I hope you enjoy this. You can subscribe to my videos and learn similar tricks to get quickly the answer for your questions. Thank you and all the best.